Fire is a natural part of Western ecosystems, including forests. Several long-term management practices of the U.S. Forest Service, though, have inadvertently made these forests more susceptible to catastrophic fires. Retired Forest Service wildlife biologist and program manager Leon Fager described some of these management issues during a September 2004 interview. What's happened to the Southwestern National Forest is that fire was part of the, the natural things that happened in all forest lands. But when livestock grazing became apparent, the grasses that carried fires, in which actually killed little seedlings of pine trees and other obnoxious things, that weeds out there, for example, was denuded by livestock to bare ground. So when fires did hit, they were in trees and they were not never allowed because there was no fuel in terms of grasses to carry the fire as a slow, intense burn that covers the country and keeps little seedlings basically thinned out naturally. You go into Mexico, uh, down in northern Mexico, northern Baja, and you see the forests down there, they're extremely park-like in fact. They're open ponderosa pine forests with grass up to your waist at times because they're not grazed like we do here. But when you have livestock grazing denuding the ground, Pondos of pine loves bare mineral soil. And there's no fire to thin it out. You consequently end up over the decades with this huge dense stands of small diameter trees, which really causes the problem with fire and throughout the, the West. 